Okay, good morning and welcome to Ian Mitzio on part of Yeshiva YouTube. Today I'm going to analyze Meister Shani Paragimel and Mishnah Tess and really tie it into Mishnah Ches also, which is part of today's Daily Double Mishnah Yomi. It talks about Meister Shani that became Tommy, both on a Darais level or a Darabonan level. Um, you're allowed to be poded in your Shalim. No sukh, I'll say, so you can't eat it. You can be poded, even though normally you can't be poded in Meister Shani as Tohor. Uh, what happens with the money? Can you leave your Shalim? And eat the fruits outside. Use the use the money to purchase fruits and eat it outside your shalayim. Now we know from the previous mishnayos that there's a concept of mechitzos koltos. Once it goes in, it can't go out. The fruits or the money you have to stay in your shalayim um, and eat it there. It's not a vacation if you have to go process it somewhere else or go uh, go in and out traveling around. You got to stay there and enjoy it there. There's a concept of machitzos koltos. Now, yesterday we talked about Niyam and Tzion. We talked about um, the difference between a goel adam and heros meiser sheni. Meiser sheni is then in the airspace. So, therefore, wherever it is, even if part of a tree is inside and it's on the branches outside, or the base of the tree is outside and the, the, the branches are inside, you go after the fruits. Because I'm going to explain more right now that there's a difference in Karkos and metatalin. Karkos is real estate. Uh, people that are confined to the ground. Normally, um, people, I would say, it's a discussion. Avodim, are they considered karkos and metatalin? But real, the Gemara says they're achud, they're hokish lekarka. They're really like karkos avodim. Um, they're like part of real real property. And people also, they're confined to the ground. So by goal adam, where the person is, the location, he always look at it based on where the ground is. So a tree that's partially in one place, partially in another place. Right, the tree is in both places, so the person wherever he is on the tree is in both places, or a mafia in both places. However, when it comes to fruits and vegetables and metal and movable objects, right, you can just throw them in there. You can't just throw people around. You can throw objects around there. Eventually, gravity will take it to the ground. But movable objects, like airplanes, you know, rocket ships, they can go up to the shamayim, you know, and drones, things like that. They defy gravity. So movable objects, you go after its physical place. So therefore. The Nakamina will also be airspace, right? If if fruits pass over the airspace of Yerushalayim, they're already Machitos Koltos. If people are in an airplane, I would say they're not Machitos Koltos, so they have to be on the ground or on a tree that's part of the ground, that's entrenched in the ground. They have to be, but it's a din of being on the ground versus the airspace, where it presently is in the airspace. So, Basilo has the, the Psach Halacha over here that you could, even if it, Everything, whether it came to me outside your shalim or to me inside your shalim, the fruits, um, you could pull it and eat it outside, which is kind of amazing. I mean, Shami disagrees with it, except where it's to me with the rabbana, because on the rice level, it's to it's, it's tar me the rice, and mechitzos koltos on the rice level, you can't leave. But if it's to me with the rice, you brought it in, the mechitzos were koltos, right? Now it's supposed to stay in your shalim, and then it became to me, and you're pulled it, you're already pulled it onto money. You can take the money and, eat, and buy things outside your shalim. How could that be? So, the Yushalmi that the Rav of Avadur quotes, he says, it must be talking about with a Tanai. He made a Tanai that I'm bringing it in, I'm not sure you could do a Machitos, that I don't want the Machitos to be called in. I don't know if you could do that if you have the ability to make such a Tanai. I don't know if the Bavli would agree with that. Um, I think it's talking about any case, the Stama, the, the regular case is talking about all cases, even if you don't make a Tanai. So, how could it be? If the Machitos are Koltos, by transferring it to money, how could you leave Yushalim and use the money there? Presumably, the Kedusha of Machine goes to the money. The answer is is that because my Yisrael Shani is a din in the payroll, so therefore, um, and now they're telling me the payroll on the rice level. They're telling me on the rice level, so therefore you can't eat it in your shalayim. So therefore, right, you can't take it out. Well, he's just cult those. But once I transfer it to the money, right, what mon- monetary objects, when I when I uh, trade real estate for real estate, right, so one really is in place of the other. They don't move. Real estate doesn't move. So, you know, there's a concept in taxes of a 1031. When you're a real estate investor, you can flip one property for another property and, you know, withhold the taxes temporarily. So <clears throat> there's a concept of one karka being exchanged for another karka. They don't really move. They're not movable objects. Movable objects move around. So when I exchange money for my fruits, that's something else. The money is something else. It's not an exact exchange. It's barter. I mean, for me, this is useful. For that, you is useful, right? Karkos basically have the same value if they're in the same general area. So... Um, so therefore, when I transfer the money to the to the money, so the so the transfer of the digital money to the money, I can take out of your line because it was collate like the fruit, but not the not the actual money, and that's why the money is on the mechizos koltos, on the mechizos koltos on the fruit. 
that would be the nafkamina, another nafkamina between movable objects and karakos. I uh, would also explain Mishnah Ches, why um, generally, when it comes, I'm not going to, you know what, for, I'll leave Mishnah Ches over here, we'll stop this share over here, it's just going to be on Mishnah Tet. Hope you enjoyed today's share, see you in the next one.